Hi friends, I have got the simplest tool for you today to take a look at what you are eating and how is it helping your body, right? We're aiming for the best well-being. You're going to feel recharged, you're going to feel energized, you're going to feel clear-headed. Let's jump right into it. Here we go. Hi friends, welcome back to Tranquility Moms. If you're new here, my name is Katherine Gardner. I am one of the moms on our Tranquility Moms team. We are here to educate and encourage you with some great tools that we have learned as therapists and as I am a health coach. Being a certified health coach, I have learned so much from the Dr. Sears Wellness Institute. It has guided me to put together the LEANS model that we've been sharing in the videos, L-E-A-N-S, how can you bring wellness through lifestyle choices, through exercise and movement, through an attitude and a positivity, nutrition and meals that you're preparing? And I've added that S for spirituality. I really feel like it is the best way that you can enhance and recharge yourself, body, mind, and soul. If you've been stuck in eating throughout the summer, eating through 2020 and 21, we've been eating our feelings. You might be feeling sluggish and lethargic, feeling like clothes don't fit. Um, it's hard to get up and get moving. You're drowsy, you're not motivated. It's hard to think straight. If those are some of the things you've been recognizing, then I have got a simple tool for changing the way that you look at food. And it comes down to traffic light eating. Dr. Sears created this system of green, yellow, and red categories. So instead of feeling like, should I be counting calories or quantity of certain groups of food, he is looking at the quality of that food. So as you get ready to go for that grocery trip and think, what should I be buying? You want to stay on the outer ring of the store, right? Those are going to be more of our natural, healthy foods. So starting in your produce section, green light eating means these are our greens from the ground, right? They are natural, our body digests them. They're gonna have great fibers and nutrients, um, your proteins, you're getting in your healthy fats, right? Our avocados. Those are the foods that you know you are enhancing the way that your body is operating. Because if we want to boost immune system in the times that we're living, we want to feel like our kids have great energy, we're more clear thinking, then I want to focus on, I know what category these foods fall into. They fall into the green foods. Next is your yellow food category. And that's going to be a little more tricky. You might say, well, this seems pretty healthy. However, it's not going to fall into the green light, which means you can have it any time you want. Yellow food category is going to mean, let's slow down, let's be cautious, and be aware of maybe this is a boxed item that's processed. It might have items on the ingredients list that you can't pronounce. Those are flags to you to say, I need to be cautious with how often I'm adding those into breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And from Dr. Sears' T5 Wellness Plan book, I'll put the link down below to our resource page. We've got an Amazon affiliate link to that book. I love that book. I've been using it for the last year. I'm implementing it and I keep coming back to it. It really has helped me to feel my best. In that book, he talks about the five mini meals, right? Are you eating? in increments that break up the day and you've got enough time in between them where you're not waiting till you're starved to be eating, it's time to eat again. And those are healthy snacks of cheese sticks or avocados uh, with some uh, simple chips, right? The chips that just have three ingredients in them. Um, we're talking about cutting up apple slices, dipping some carrots into hummus, right? Adding in some snacks. He talks about his smoothies. Dr. Sears has these wonderful recipes for smoothies. I'll put the link down below. As you are doing your five mini meals, 
and you're looking at, all right, what am I putting in that green category, green food category, yellow food category, but what about that red light category? Are you thinking, oh no, I can never have a donut again? <laughs> no. The answer is, is everything in life is in moderation. So you've recognized and identified it in that red light category. So you know, let's be cautious about it. As you're eating throughout the week, if you know that on Saturday you're going over to a friend's house for a football party or a backyard barbecue, and you say, okay, I know that I'm gonna be grazing and eating some of the wonderful homemade foods, but they're going to be higher in sugars. Okay, well then I will be cautious as in the days leading up to that, am I focusing more on my green light and yellow light categories? Because that's really going to be where you feel less guilt about saying it's okay that in moderation I'm able to enjoy some of these brownies. You are recognizing if you are somebody who says, but I crave a lot of those red light foods. Well, there are ways to get some of that same satisfaction but be in more control. So instead of going to the grocery store and buying some boxed items that have been sitting there for days and weeks and who knows how they're being preserved, why don't you find the recipe to then identify that you can make it. You're managing and controlling what goes into that homemade brownie recipe. So traffic light eating. This week, take a look moms. If you are wanting to recharge that battery Let's get rid of some of the sluggishness coming in from the yucky foods that we've been eating. Junk food makes us feel like junk, unfortunately. So this week in your grocery shopping, in your meal preparation, in your planning ahead, focus on green light, yellow light versus red light categories. I hope this information has been helpful to you. Please, it's our best compliment if you give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. We put out videos every week and blog posts to add more details to all of these health tips, wellness for moms. My name is Katherine Gardner. I'm so glad that you are here. And today, take care of yourself.